Oh, buddy. This is our hummingbird we found. I'm trying to rescue him. Fed him some naked juice mango as best we could. Don't want it to go down his nose hole so he gets pneumonia. He may have ran into a window, just ran out of energy. It's cold That's outside right like now. Four hours, like two of those sites said four hours at least for, for him to recover. Mm -hmm. So he can't be left outside. A dog came right, right by where he was too. So we brought him into our room. He too had run on the line. But <laughs> I know. Do you think he's warm enough? Fun. He's just kind of got a. He's. It's not wrapped around him though. He's on the washcloth. His, his head is totally backwards, it like rotates 360. He's looking around, that's a good sign. Yeah, that is good, he's looking around. He's right alert, now. his eyes aren't half closed. He's this is our hummingbird. He's also been like just laying, doing nothing. There he goes, oh bless his heart. He's trying to fly. So we've been trying to feed him there this. There he goes. He won't go far though. We've got no energy. We can't release him now because it's mm. night. We gave him a little bit of this on the bed. side Just of his beak. And uh, Mrs. Nutton Fancy's talking to last suspect and Tattle yeah, Doodle. He probably is. Doesn't know where he's at. Oh. Shit, he's in my hair. It's okay. Scare me. Oh. Just chill out. He just needs a place. Oh. Relax. He's doing on me. He's fine. He's just sitting on your shoulder, dude. Oh, look how sweet he is. I'm so glad he's kind of come to a little bit. Look at me, hon. She's terrified of him, by the way. You don't like little animals to die. I don't want them dying. Well, he likes you, so just... We do everything in our power to rescue animals oh that come God, into our care. My shoulder. In this case, it's going to be a hummingbird. I'm thinking he'll spend the night with us. I'll just put him in All uh, right. well, a we can... cup and cover him so he's quiet. Then come daytime when he can navigate better, maybe I can feed him he some more juice, he'll be underway problem. again. Turn the light off because it's going. kind of bugging him a bit. It wasn't. Look how cute he is. It was I love sending, so I just, so cool. I'd send him first and I'm like, oh, just show, show to you. See, he's tired just from that little mini flight right there. He's huffing and puffing. But his wings are working. His wings are working, yeah. So he has no him. broken wings. That's a good thing. <laughs> he's totally settling in on your shoulder. It's probably going to nest in my hair for the night. Well, he can feel your body heat too, hon. So he likes that. Aww. I know. So subscribe to my Twitter feed and I'll tell you what happens oh, with our little hummingbird Wait, friend. If I can, but if, it, if it's, it's a like happy ending, I'll try to film it. If it's over three quarters of an inch long as beak. Hummingbirds and TMP. Mm -hmm. Love them. Yes. I hope you can eat some more and get energy. They burn Alrighty. a lot of energy. Well, they have to eat like posted. multiple times their body weight every day just to keep their wing beats going. Oh, to feed her. See on she's Twitter, got water. she's talking about Alley Dog now. Looks like he's sleeping. He's so precious. So hummingbirds go into a dormant state at night. So I put them in this mini ice bucket with a washcloth. Halfway covered to keep them warm. Because he needs to rest up. He doesn't have the energy for anything more. And the plan is in the morning I'll let him go. See if he'll fly away.
He's asleep in that little bowl. See, come look how he's breathing when he's dormant. Hun. Look at him. Isn't that cute? That was a good little nest for him. We didn't want to let him go last night because it was uh, too cold and dark. I don't know if he could have made it. So we just kind of kept him in here. Yeah, but it's daylight and you can at least see where he's going. We should let him sleep longer. I know. Warm up a little bit more, huh? Yeah. Looks pretty comfortable in there. What do you think? Let him sleep longer? He's gonna need some food. No, that's our worries, because these guys go through calories so much. They lose one-tenth of their body weight at night. Cycle trip, in case you're wondering. Okay, buddy, come here. It might be time to wake up. I hope he's okay. Mm -hmm. I just don't know. Buddy. Ah, the light goes off and on. It's kind of stupid. I love her. Are you alert? Ready for some nectar? God, that's retarded. I know. That's bad. Oh, we can't hear him. There you go, bud. Can you see? See, I think he's still asleep. He's okay. Hey, buddy. Are you okay? I think he's still asleep. little creatures. Get your little tongue out, my friend. Most people would have stepped on this thing on the sidewalk. Mm -hmm. Hey. That's a sad ending. I can't post a video, I guess. Mm -hmm. 
Maybe he's not ready to wake up. He might be in a dormant stage still. <laughs> Look, he, he's breathing. Yeah. He's normal, but he's in a dormant stage, I think. Well, he's more breathing heavier now. goal is to get him back in his little wild home I don't know why I'm speaking so quietly because he's not waking up he's sweet I'm not sure what type he is I'm sure I could look it up with his coloration there's no ruby throat here so I don't think he's a ruby throat unless he's, he's a she this is a female. Look at how iridescent the feathers are. Mm -hmm. They are funny little creatures, aren't they? Some of my favorite, actually. A silly bird. Wake up. It's daytime out. What I can do is just I'll leave the bucket open. He can start flying around and he'll tell us when he's ready to go. Mm -hmm. There's a little activity. Oh, bud. Wake up. Wake Make up. Food, no silly. Wake up. Silly? Yeah, you're supposed to wake up. It's funny how his personality is. He's actually quite trusting. Mm -hmm. He jumped right onto the shoulder of the missus and just chose that his perching point yesterday. Doesn't really try to run. God, I bet these are just so easy for cats to get. Oh. I can't really feed him when he's not up. See, that to me looks like normal behavior. Yeah. How he's doing that, that what, that's what he'd be doing in his nest. It's just kind of, see his breathing, how shallow and fast it is? That looks like dormancy breathing, which we looked up is designed to save calories, strangely enough. I hope that's what that is. Just not out of the woods yet. I mean, he could die right here in this room. We're doing everything we can to prevent that. Come on, buddy. Mm -hmm. Do you want to wake up? Do you want to wake up? You can go home now. I could take it outside, but he's got to kind of show some signs of life here. He probably likes how warm it is here, don't you think? Mm -hmm. <laughs> See how he just opened and then he went back to sleeping? Maybe he's on a biological clock or something that's too early. It's 6.50 in the morning right here. I just don't know. I can feel his little heart beating in my hand. We take care of all creatures who cross our path. Do the best we can to rescue them. It's just the way we are. The boys are way that way, aren't they? Mm -hmm. Doodle last suspect. And when you saw Mrs. Nut and Fancy on the phone earlier in the video, she was talking to the boys about the little hummingbird. After we'd done some online searching about their characteristics and how they do it. He probably likes the heat of the hand too. Mm -hmm. Man, I hope he wakes up.
Okay, I'm going to give him a little bit and I'll see if he comes to. See, look at that. That looks normal. I was just kind of. Mm -hmm. That's what he'd be doing in the nest. Kind of rotates his head to see what's going on in his environment. Yeah, it's morning time. You can wake up. <laughs> That's right. It's morning time. You can actually leave if you want. Oh, there we go. He's popping alive. Boy. See, he's showing some life right there. Mm. Now let me see if I can get some energy in him. Holy cow, that's amazing. He just came too right there. Hello. What you want to see is his throat move. Come on, stick your little tongue out, buddy. That's what we'd really, really like. Stick your tongue out. Watch his throat and see if he'll swallow. Guys, come on. You, did you see him? any nectar this is actually naked juice like we're saying perfect for this actually we're really lucky to have it yeah oh that's good okay so let's go see if he'll fly okay bye. i don't even get that i don't even support it i'm just showing these guys no. so you can see how we're carrying them because i don't want to put my hand around because it makes his feathers moist Right here. Why? It's a clear takeoff. Oh, okay. I don't want to be around those windows back there. Well, I was just saying back there, there's like a bunch of flowers and. No, he's not. I think he's just getting his, his bearings, I hope. Hey, buddy. There you go. Got our. This is nothing fancy here, there. Do you have energy to fly? Might take him a while to calibrate his instruments. Hey, you. You. That's right. You're outside now. See, you go over there and the bark and see if we got flowers. I don't think he'll like fly immediately over there to the flowers. I think he's freaking traumatized. Aww. These are the windows I think he ran into last night, but I'm not sure. Come on, buddy. Where's that energy I saw you have? Huh? Where's that energy? Yes. Do you not have energy? To fly, we want you to have energy. Okay, you can see how it is to rescue wildlife, sweetheart. You need to get going here. Do you have energy? I should have brought the nectar and see if he could fly. Eat that nectar. Yeah, but he keeps closing his eyes. That's not good. Yeah, I know. They These little birds are so temperamental. I've rescued so many that die overnight. They just can't make it. See how I covered him and I made sure there's no drafts or coldness getting to him? That's a, a way that they don't make it. So if you rescue a bird, quiet place. Unless he's flying around and landing in your hair, apparently. That's... That's not good. Oh, buddy. Little buddy, you need to fly. See his eyes closing now. I see he was coming to life though. They're in the room. That's what I can't figure out. He's doing so. Oh. There he goes. There Go he goes. On. Go on. There he Go goes. On. Oh. Hang on. Hang on. Is it gonna fall? They can get on your little limb there, dude. There you go. I just don't know how much energy he has. 
And I don't know how, it, we need to feed them. Can you go up and go get that nectar? It's in my right pocket. That's not the card. Don't want him to fall on those rocks. I'll try to feed you some more naked juice, my friend. You gotta eat though. You need that energy to fly. Do you not understand that? See, that's not normal right there, what he's doing. He should be alert and ready to go right now. He's still going back to sleep. Here, you try to feed him my film. Just see if you can get anything in his little... Call it. I was trying down at the corners of his mouth. Do you not see what that is, Try not silly. to crust his feathers. <gasps> oh, come on, buddy. Oh, come on, buddy. Oh, come on, buddy. He's having a hard time. There's another one. That's a mom. Look at him, he's doing pretty good. That's him right there, isn't it? Oh my gosh. Look at that. That is so freaking epic. It's okay. Mom's got him. Or his mate, whoever it is. Okay, I just missed filming it, but our little hummingbird friend was right here on the washcloth and we stepped away for a minute. He wasn't doing anything, just kind of sitting there and I came and tried to feed him again and he showed some signs of life and he flew over and landed right here and then he got his breath and he took off vertical right there and I lost sight of him. That's about as good of an outcome as we can hope for with this rescue. So, um, not sure if he's an adolescent and that's mom hanging out with him, but he's back in the wild doing what little hummingbirds do in the wild. I'll save you that song. Ah, that does the heart good. Our whole vacation about a little hummingbird. I wish I could see him in the trees, guys. I would show them to you if I could. I think they may have bolted, and I don't hear them either. That fancy project, wildlife rescue. Make sure you sub. That's a pretty good outcome, I think. Pretty happy about that. Rescue complete.